Hello and welcome back to Delta Rune. Who would have Delta Rune even sorry, I can't even pronounce the name properly. I do apologize on my second can of beer tonight, but it's it's good to be back. And not only that, it's good to be back to Delta Rune. Who would have thought chapter two would have actually have turned up at all? Apparently it was uh, in hiatus for a bit, but that's that's fine, you know, if it was, it was. I really enjoyed chapter one. Uh, and I obviously enjoyed Under Tale as well. I thought that was a great game. Chapter 2 is here, ladies and gentlemen. I have not seen any footage of it. I didn't even know it was out until my YouTube feed. Uh, I saw Manly Badass here and Jack Sepp's guy were doing it. And I was like, wait, Delta Room Chapter 2? It's here? And it is. So I have downloaded it. And as you can see on the screen here, chapter one was completed. It was because I have done a let's play of that chapter and I kept my data for it. It knows it, which is really cool. So that means I don't have to replay it again to get to where we are. In which case then, hello all, welcome back to Delta Room, the let's play blind with Near Rambler. This is, Del this is uh, chapter two. Not the best introduction, I apologize because again, it's been a while since I've done videos. But I've got a bit of free time coming up now. Uh, my studies are complete for the moment so we can get back to it so yes no more faffing around no more slurring words no more trying to make myself out to be a professional let's start chapter two ladies and gentlemen i can't wait i cannot wait I've, i haven't been this excited about a game for a long time brilliant sounds like that um um Oh god, it sounds like that laughter from, um, it's that, oh, what's it, Final Fantasy 6, which is Final Fantasy 3 on the SNES in America, is it Clefter, the, the, the bad guy in that game, he has that laughter, it sounds just like that, that's awesome. Yeah, we're going to do Neo, we're just going to crack on with it, let's start please, this will start chapter 2 in file slot 1, damn straight you will. Chris? Chris, honey, are you awake? Wait, is that a... Uh, yeah, I was just, I do actually remember, oh dear. I was going to say, I remember the end of the chapter. Uh, did you eat all of the pie? <laughs> okay, so we're going to start the long-awaited next chapter of this game with a did you eat all the pie joke. You know what? I'm with it. That's absolutely fine. Yeah, because remember, at the end of chapter one, there was that creepy ass thing where he pulled his heart out, didn't he? And he, the, the heart that would be in Undertale. I, I can't actually remember that much about the chapter one of this game, to be honest. But I remember the ending, and you were like, oh, some dark shit's happening. So, yeah. But anyway, did you eat all the pie? Is your knife in this empty tin, is it not? <laughs> I get it. It was a... Oh, what's the word for it? It was a... It was a thing. Oh, Chris. Am I going to have to lock the oven again? You can lock ovens? I didn't even know that was a thing. Well, hurry off out of bed. It's time for school. Chris is like, fuck that shit. I tore my fucking heart out last night and stuck it in the fucking little cage thing down there and we're controlling it ladies and gentlemen we are here we are back in the world of delta room like i said i've been really looking forward to this i really enjoyed chapter one no joke and uh i liked undertale i like this this is gonna be great it's stained yeah i wonder why chris i wonder why it's a bird cage. When the doors close, there's no escape. Oh, good. Thanks for the undertone of ultimate doom and demise. I love that. On the computer desktop is a folder called Epic Game Stuff. Ah, oh, it's a poorly drawn design for a game. It seems the last boss is a creature with giant rainbow wings. Doesn't seem like this game ever saw the light of day. Is that, a, is that Toby Fox telling us something there? I don't know. Again, I'm not that well informed, I don't know. Well, I hope not. It might be like a an internal joke for Undertale. I can't remember the because yeah. I don't know. I'm overthinking. Who cares? Let's just let's just enjoy. There's five dollars in your brother's drawer, take it. Uh no. 
It isn't yours after all. Yeah, we may be a dickhead, but we're not going to be that much of a dickhead. Clothes drawer. That is good. Your bed. Well, make your bed then. Don't be a lazy dick. Come on. Well, fine. Be that way then. You won't steal five dollars from your brother's drawer, but you won't make your bed. Pfft. He's the bad guy now, eh? Even after a long night, the sunrise is the same as always. Well, that's good, because if it wasn't, there'd be problems, though. Underneath the bed is an old cartridge of Cat Pepper's RPG. Catty and Catty can be seen faintly written on it in warm gel pen. What? Really? Did you write on your cartridges? I've never written on my game cartridges before. I suppose, like, if it was a pirate copy thing, maybe you would. Okay. Oh, well, let's, let's, let's roll, then. There's no time to read books, just generally. <laughs> There's always time to read a book if you are that dedicated. A cactus. There's not much to say about it. Prickly. How to draw dragons is at the bottom of the drawer. The purple character on the cover is dressed immodestly. Your brother will never return this book. Oh, dude. I mean, oh, thanks, Chris. It's what they call you. Yeah, that's very true. That is what they call you. Doesn't necessarily mean it is you. Door is locked, and I know that because I read. Uh, oh God, it was a short story from H.P. Lovecraft. I forgot what it was called. Oh, I cursed my alcoholic brain. It's very good. All right then, downstairs we go. Oh, oh got straight to the bathroom then. I didn't even know we could. Could I actually wait a minute? In that case, then I actually pressed the the action button to go through the other door. Can I go into that door then? No, it is locked. That is fine. That is fine. I just wanted to check that I wasn't being stupid. I'll try it again. I'm going to try and explore as much as I can in this game. So forgive me if I'm a bit slow compared to others. I won't be editing that many things out unless I get stuck for a bit. I'm like, all right, I'll see you guys in a bit. Blah, 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 blah. It is not yet time to wash your hands. It's always time to wash your hands. It's a toilet. Flush it. Damn straight. Oh, well. You flush the toilet. Damn good. Yeah, look, I didn't steal five bucks from my brother's drawer. I didn't make my bird, mind you. But hey, you can't be a complete non-dick. But I did flush the toilet. That is good. I feel accomplished. On the shower ledge, there's a small container of apple-scented shampoo. And a gallon-sized container of pet shampoo. Aww. Don't be mean. Yeah, okay. I'll just see if you comment on the curtain. But obviously not. Okay. That's fine. Uh, what have we got? Uh, sink. There is some white fur stuck in the drain. Did I say that before last time? Can't remember. There's some cinnamony batter caked on the oh, uh, cinnamony batter caked on the stove top. Oh well, we can always clean that. Cookie cutters for gingerbread monsters and gingerbread humans. Uh -huh. It's a trash can. Somehow its floral scent has increased. Oh, well, that, that is good. We don't want a non-floral scent trash can. At least I don't. Anyway, there's a photo on the fridge. It's of you, your mother, and your brother. Are you happy about that, Chris, or are you still being a dick? It's a trash can. Oh, well, I was actually looking at the picture frame on the wall, but okay. It's a landline phone, but you already have a cell phone. All right. It's Cheriel, the beloved living room chair. <laughs> it's the TV. Looks like it's plugged in, but it's dusty. Oh. And no comment on this chair. Oh, dear. Is that the missing father? Mm -mm. And no comment on the sofa either. Is that the missing other father? It's a book of hymns. And no other comments on that. Interesting. Okay. Well, shall we go? Uh, yeah. Oh, it's automatically doing it. So let's do it then. I just thought, are we going to talk about that bunker thing at the end of the chapter one? That was a scary bunker. Chris, there you are. Even Susie showed it before you. <laughs> Oh. oh, I remember Susie. They had the big adventure in Chapter 1. Hey, Chris. I knew you were going to be late. I wouldn't have showed up on time. Oh, yeah, because Chris went on a bit of a character. That sort of character development arc, didn't, didn't they? Now. And now we're going to fuck that all up. Susie, please don't kick your desk. Treat school property like you treat people. Well, you've just sewn yourself up there. Okay. Next time I'll aim for the vitals. 
That's not what I... Oh, in any case, good morning, class. We have a lot to go over today. First, we're starting the reading from page 142. Any... Uh, any volunteers? Um, uh, I guess I could read the... Ah, trouble yourself not, Noel. I will violently take this blow of humiliation. Just, just, you know, just a side note here, I used to be a teacher. And yeah, it was always difficult to get students to volunteer. And apparently it was always frowned upon here in the UK. Because if, uh, you know, if you were trying to get a student to volunteer to answer a question or read some passage out or something like that, and they didn't want to do it, a teacher's instinct is to just pick a random name. You know, you just go, oh, well, you, you, you. Charlotte, you do it. You you read the thing. And then they'd be like, Ooh, and then they'd sometimes read it, sometimes they wouldn't. Apparently we weren't allowed to do that because I would mentally scar them. Oh yes. It was very annoying. Anyway, I understand. Um, that, uh, that's okay, I can... <clears throat> Page uh, 142. It was the best of times. It was the worst of times. Times are pretty good. Times are pretty bad. Mediocre times. Iffy times. So-so times. Listening to this, your eyes began to close automatically. Oh, well, it's a classic material. I know when you're young, you don't, weren't interested. No, nobody's interested in the classics when you're young. Even the, even the people who have to, who are like well off and they go to the private schools because they've got you know family bloodline, you know aristocratic thing, or they're just you know wealthy middle class working class people who may pay for a private school and all that shit none of them like the classics i mean uh you know they they do their bit to to learn it but they don't bloody like it do they and if they do then well they're just weird no i've got anything against classics or anything it's just um i, I don't know it, it, it you have to appreciate it for what they are have a nice day everyone and please remember your group projects oh um Chris, are you okay? You were, um, sleeping or class. D d don't worry, I'm not mad, j j j just concerned. Usually you only sleep through the start. Good luck and rest well tonight, okay? Wow, really? God, you are a softy, aren't you? Blimey, I mind you, having said that, if I did meet a student like Chris, there was only ever, in my teaching career, as short as it was, there was only ever one student who I would ultimately say I was quite scared of and was quite evil. Um they were able to basically have the whole system wrapped right around their little finger. That that was annoying. I was generally ultimately thought that student was evil. But other than that I've been pretty lucky. I've had some misbehaving ones of course, but I always found something good about them. Like you could tell. Yeah it wasn't for them. I used to teach science and maths easily. Looks like motivational quotes from various literature. Try your best, Astral Wolf, even in your darkest hour. That one seems to be from a video game. Yeah, I thought that. Where's Astral Wolf from? I have no idea. It rings a bell. It's a bunch of roses. Aww. It, oh, oh, okay. The computer wallpaper is updated. How can you tell? You're looking at the back of the monitor! The buff embracing heroes are now edited to be four inches apart. There's dialogue about proper distancing at the school dance. Ah, oh, so reference to COVID. You wonder if your mother had some influence on this change, probably. You check the time. It seems to not be time for class. Yeah, all right, game. Don't be such a smart ass. Chris, this whole partner thing. You didn't lose sleep over it, did you? Oh, God, yeah, they were partnered up for projects, weren't they? That's right, and he was partnered... I think he was partnered up with... Sophie, I believe? I think so. I can't remember. Yeah, I vaguely remember that now. Uh, lost sleep from being Susie's partner, actually my sleep quality increased. Well, I'm guessing that's the dickish response, because to be fair, like I try to be the good guy here. I know it's boring, but I am that person. Um, kind of both statements are a bit moot, because I don't want to be mean to Susie, because we did... Well, I bonded with Susie as a player through the character of Chris, but Chris themselves probably didn't. Um, but you say, actually, my sleep quality increased. We ripped our heart out and threw it in a cage. I mean, I suppose if you did that to help you sleep, you definitely would be able to sleep afterwards, despite the initial pain of throwing your heart in a cage. But 
well, actually, no, I suppose your quality of sleep would be increased because you'd never wake up. So, yeah, actually, no, my sleep quality increased. Okay. Her, Chris, that's um, good, I think. So maybe you were just staying up late talking to Asriel on mine again. Asriel, that was the kid, that was the flower kid from the first, uh, from Undertale. Oh, wait, you you can't do that, right? Uh, I hope the internet gets fixed soon. Uh, I don't want to revert to my, I don't want to revert into my primal form. Um, okay. I have no idea what you're hinting at there. Get a good sleep tonight, okay? Alright, Chief, will do. Well, I'll try, I'm sure if I can't wait for my heart, I'll rip up my lungs or something. Uh-oh. Susie's not impressed. Well, look who it is. The school zombie. You were sleeping like a corpse all class. Well, I need anything to wake me up, you cheeky bitch. What's the matter? I had trouble going beddy by last night. Actually, I did, yeah, because I ripped my heart out. It was really painful. Oh, sorry. Got my YouTube video clicking away on that one. Oh, god darn it. Sorry, I know it's not very professional. I've left my... Hang on, hang on. Let's just cancel that. That's it. There we go. Sorry, yeah, I had um, YouTube on in the background. I switched it off and then switched back on. I've got these cheap headphones that keep... Uh, they got like this microphone switch button thing on. It's so cheap. It just it's so sensitive. It keeps uh, tripping off the background. Do apologize. Right. Anyway, back 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 into back to focus. I had trouble going to bed by last night. Uh, yes, I did. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Me too, Chris. <laughs> oh God. All right. Jesus. Like I could sleep after yesterday. Yeah, admittedly. Oh yeah, it would be yesterday for you. It's been a while since then. Just waiting for today felt like years. Did did all that stuff really happen? Lancer, Ralsei, everyone, the, that jester thing, when I had to do that boss fight and I had to do it at an extra fast speed, for some reason my game isn't running properly, are they still? Look, you've been wondering the same thing, right? Come on already! Oh, so we go back to the closet, aren't we? Oh, bless. Yeah, cause Susie was, Susie didn't fully develop, obviously, but, um, yeah. Alright, Chris, this is it. Moment of truth. Everything we've been waiting for is just behind this. If we uh, open this and there's nothing inside, we'll uh, we still be. Screw it! Let's just open it already. Um, S Susie. Yeah. Noel. Uh, hey. What? What the hell? Who are you doing here? Oh, did they have a thing? Is there a thing? There might have been a thing between them. Like, they weren't, like... Oh, I don't know. I think there was. I don't think they acknowledged it, but I think there was a thing. Um, sorry to bother you, but... Um, I... Uh, well, I just... Uh, Birdly and I were going to the library to... Uh, do some research uh, for our group projects, and... If it's okay, um... Would you... Want to come too? Yeah, I think there's a thing going on between these two. Uh, oh, Chris, you can come too, I mean. That's no, alright, no, I get it. I get it. Are you a girl? Is this a girl, girl, gay thing? Don't know, doesn't matter. Point being is, you, you carry on. I've got lungs to rip out. Uh, I mean... We're like... Uh, busy with the... Chris, help me out here. What do I say? Um, <laughs> crime. We're busy with crime. <laughs> or hanging out alone in the closet. Uh, that's a hard one because both are just weird things. Like, Noel isn't going to be impressed with either of them. I mean, if we say hanging out alone in the closet, that might insinuate that we've got like a thing. But if we say crime, that might turn Noel off. Uh, duh. Uh, I want to say crime. I know it sounds a bit dickish, but uh, I suppose hanging out alone in the closet is a closet joke. And I know we're very sensitive these days, but I can't resist a joke. Hanging out alone in the closet. Yeah, you know, just chilling out alone in the closet. Just two friends chilling out in the closet like normal. Touching and stuff. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, um, well, uh, that sounds, um, 
just uh, have fun, you two. I'll um, I'll be at the library. <laughs> oh God, no! Because I see, if I'd have said crime, she'd have been upset. If I'd have just said something innocently naive and um, innuendo, here, she could get away with it. Chris, if you could, if you could. Chris, oh, Chris, if you could bring her by later. Yeah, I will, Noel. I'll find a way. Don't worry. Like I said, I'm just I'm an emo. I just rip lungs and legs off. It's fine. It would mean a lot to me. All right, all right. I'll get on with it. Don't worry. I'll sort something out. Don't worry. Um, uh, actually, wait. Wait a second, Susie. I am. Um, I, I I have something for you. Oh. Okay. See you. Bye. <laughs> Oh, it's so sweet. I love this game. Oh, well, I love Chapter 1 anyway, and I loved Undertale. And, and I'm actually quite, I will admit, I'm quite a conservative, uh, I wouldn't say right wing, so I'd be harsh, but I'm quite sort of like centre conservative, uh, not just in politics or anything like that, but like society wise. But I can't, I, I like this. This is genuine. This is nice. And when I say genuine, I mean, I know it's fiction, but this is like. This feels cool. It feels like this is genuinely happening like between people. It's just sweet. I can't stop this. It's cool. It's it's a lunchbox? Full of chalk. <laughs> oh, I, I'm sure she meant well. She had chalk the whole time. <laughs> I'm sure she meant well. And didn't give it to Alphys? Yeah, see? Hey. Hey, maybe Noelle's a little bit more, you know, savvy and crooked than we give her credit for. What the hell, Chris? Here, you hold on to this. You got the chalk. Wait, Chris, what the hell was that? Um, I think that was a romantic gift, Chief. Why would Noelle ask me to do homework with her? Deathwise much? D oh, deathwish much, sorry. D does she want to fail? No, I, 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 yeah, come on, bro. I mean, girl. Wait, wait a second. Wait a second, Chris. Did you, did you notice how nervous she was, and like, blushing and stuff? Chris, you don't think she, uh, she's onto our secret identities? <laughs> oh, Susie, you damn bitch. <laughs> you know this dark world stuff. Damn, we got to keep this under wraps, Chris. This is our thing, you know? Anyway, enough waiting already, alright? Let's go. Oh, Susie, you, you blind girl. Well, I'm surprised Chris is still going with it, to be fair. I know Susie's excited. But I didn't think Chris would be. Because after what happened at the end of chapter one, but oh well. I guess not. Oh, look, this looks like the bottom of a penis. Hmm. Not being crude, just saying. Cool. Well, here we go then. Back in... The, oh, what's the world called? Oh, I forget now. How do I run faster? Oh, yeah. There you go. Sorry, I'm using the Xbox 360 controller because that's all I could afford. Right. Oh, what was it called? Dark, it's dark something. I'm sure it was. Here we are. Chris! Susie! It's been ever so long. Well, that's not my fault, but you need to talk to Toby Fox. Although... No, not not knocking Toby Fox. He's, I'm, I'm very grateful that he did chapter two, or here, her, or her, or they, or whatever. Point being is, is I'm very grateful that they've done chapter two, even if it just ends up at chapter two. I, I'm grateful. Yeah, yeah, it's been what a day. Oh, that is sure, isn't it? It's just that I've I've never had friends before. I can't remember you now. So I've never waited so long to see them again either. I guess we'll try not to let you die of loneliness. I bet Lance wants to see us too, right? Hey, wait a sec. Where is Lancer? Who was Lancer? Oh, I vaguely remember. Where's everybody? Well, we've really just arrived. Worry not, Susie. You'll see them in a moment. Just wait here, all right? Okay. Hey, this better not be some kind of prank or something. Well, I don't know. We've just gone into the magical closet like we did last time, and we've now entered back into the world that we came from from the end of the first chapter. I don't think it's a prank. It might be a like a surprise, but which is, I suppose you could say is a prank, but it's not. It's not an actual prank. 
Chris, I have something to ask you. I need you to return to the light world and go to the old classroom to the east of the closet doors. Inside, gather everything on the ground and bring it back here. Could you? Uh, uh, okay. I'm just going to check that the recording's going okay first and then, yeah, sure. I'll, I'll fuck off then. Alright, back in a bit. Okay, everything seems to be going alright, so sure. But could you give us some more detail? Chris, go to the old classroom and bring everything back here. It's where you returned to the light world last time. Head east after you exit the dark world. So, Ralsei, you're not going to put your hat back on? Right, did I look cuter before? Uh, no, I just mean... You, you think I look cuter now? It was just nicer seeing less of you. You're making me blush. Oh, did they have a thing going as well? I can't remember. It's been so long. Ooh, is that a savey thing? I love the design of the world. It's very, um... I wouldn't say foreboding or anything. It's kind of cartoony in a sort of Tim Burton style. Like, do you know what? This this aesthetic of this, the houses and the buildings, it kind of reminds me of Toon World from Yu-Gi-Oh! The, the, if you look at the Toon World spell cards, the original one, not Toon Kingdom, but Toon World. The original, de well, I say the original depiction. There was one depiction, the main depiction we had in the West compared to these. Um, it looks just like that. It looks really cool, like Fiends. What was it called? Fiends chapter or whatever it was. It was pretty neat. You look upon the castle and you've, you first saw yesterday. You're filled with the power of immediate nostalgia. Yes, I am. And I'm going to save. And I noticed here, if you look on the top right, even though our level's gone back to two, time is at 468.20. Now, that's not me playing this ahead or anything. That's carrying on from chapter one. That's pretty cool, that is. So, thank you, Toby, for making it so that uh, um, you can carry... Because I'm actually playing this via Steam, whereas last time I had to download it through a separate thing. That's pretty cool. Ooh, what's this? The rubble on the ground seems to have been dusted and polished. Someone around here really cares about the details. Well, that's good. I'm guessing that's Toby then with the game development. Or it's an inside thing. But yeah, before we go to the um, light world, let's have a wonder. No one's looking. Hug the dummy? Uh, hell yeah. You hugged the dummy. Nothing wrong with a little extra fluffiness in your life? Don't fuck it straight. No, fluffiness is great. As long as they don't think I'm assaulting them or anything like that, in which case, uh, I apologise. Ooh, the doors. It seems to be locked. It may never open again. I don't know what that is. I can't remember. I don't know if we've actually come across that before, whether that's uh, a reference to the monster world from Undertale or something about Chapter 1, but again, it's been so long I've completely forgotten. Okay. Whoa. Well, it says to go east, which I believe is this way, but I'm going to go west. I'm going to explore. The door is locked. Oh, fuck you, game. Come on, let me explore. The whole point of these games is to go and break the fourth wall, isn't it? Let's have a look. That doesn't seem like the way to the old classroom. No, I'm just exploring. Might even want some water. You ran the water fountain. It's lukewarm. Oh no, you don't want to drink that then. That would be full of bacteria and all kinds of other nasty stuff. That doesn't seem like the way to the old classroom. I was just checking if there was some secret easter egg stuff. I apologise. Sorry, Toby. You know, you treated us so well before. You know, you've got to expect me to... Uh... What? I... Oh, sorry, hang on. YouTube's bothering me again. Sorry about this. Right. You gathered all the junk off the floor. Good. And turned it into a giant dusty ball. Oh, oh, okay. All right. Sorry. Hang on. I'm just checking something off. Uh... Hang on. Just checking something important. I do apologise. Um. Hold on. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, yeah, I'm, I'm sure it's fine. Sorry, I was just sorting out some staff stuff from work. I do apologise. Turned it into a giant dusty ball. Oh dear. Oh, okay. At least you managed to balance it on your head. Managed to cram everything into the closet, even the rug. 
That rug really tied the room together, did it not? Um, what's this door then? We will never know. The door is locked. Oh, at least it reacts to it. Okay. Well, fair enough then. Back we go then. Whee! Hey, Chris, so where is every... One. Oh... Yes, because... Um, didn't at the end of chapter one, you could go to that classroom. And there was like from the the um the stuff on the floor it kinda of hinted at that everything that we'd gone through was like in our imagination or something like that. Like all the stuff on the floor of that classroom was like a reference to the world we were at. Something like that anyway. I think so. Again, it's been so long. Guess who's but oh you Lancer, I remember you now. Yes, Lancer, yeah, he was like the suedo bad guy, but then he wasn't in the end, bless him. Sorry, I'm just uh, sorting out something on the thing. Right, yeah. Lancer! Oh, yes, they got on well, didn't they? They were like friends. Hey, Chris, don't know what you did, but hell yeah! Everyone's here! That's good. But, uh, what happened to uh, Lancer's castle? Oh, God! gone? Right, uh, when Chris sealed the fountain, that dark world, that's what it was, disappeared and turned back into a normal classroom. So where's Lancer going to live now? Ah, don't worry Susie, we'll conquer Ralsei's castle as our own. Of course. Chris, as you bring dark world denizens back here, the power of our fountain uh, will transform this town more and more. From now on, the enemies we spare will be recruited to our town. So let's keep sparing enemies, okay? Right, yes. Um, or sparring, depends on how you read it, I suppose, but I think it is sparring. No, sparring is double R, isn't it? Yeah, sorry, I'm trying to be smart and I'm, I'm, I'm being dumb. Yes, because that's to keep us good. Obviously, you don't have to, because I'm going to assume a bit like Undertale, where there's like at least two endings, isn't there? There's like the bad roots. The, no, it's three endings. The bad root, neutral root, and then the good roots. I'm going to try and do that in this let in this let's play. I'm going to try and do the good roots. Uh, initially, anyway. Anyhow, why don't we all have a look around? We can head north towards the castle. I have a special surprise to show you there. Ha 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 ha! Now if I surprise myself first! Last one there is a fresh and fragrant egg! Come on, Chris. You going to let him beat us? Yeah, I am actually, because I want to explore. See, I've got to remember all the controls and everything now. So we've got 971 D dollars. Um, oh, is it kept our? Oh, it's kept. Is that kept our equipment from last time? I'm not sure if it did or not. Yeah, Jevil stale. That Jevil was the 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 um. I mean, she wasn't Jev. She wasn't Jevil the 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 jester. I can't remember now. Oh, that's cool if it did. Oh, that's really cool. Party dojo. <laughs> help. Oh, all right. Well, let's go to the help desk first. Then. <gasps> oh, the, the three-headed cat thing. Oh, he was cool. He was. Yeah, I remember. So, oh, and the, the yeah, the thing, the boxy dude thing. It's a rearrange his thing. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, I love the trippy background. I'm battle master. Oh, I'm battles master. Even ask me about battles. Uh, yeah, I need to know more about stuff. Uh, grazing. When shots aimed, at, yes, that's it. It's all coming back to me now. When shots aimed directly, try to move slow. Sorry, I'm opening up another beer. I can do that. They aim where you were, not when you go, or where you go, even when you go, where you go. Take the advantage and move bit by bit. Oh, I see. Okay, you'll gain TP, but you won't get hit. All right, well, appreciate that. Okay, what about hole then? We reached our monthly funding goal. I will now talk about our hole. It was dark, filled with darker dollars, fed from subscription by our followers. Hmm. Working hard, no bank, no lender. We received one unit of legal tender. Thanks for donating. Is that an inside inside joke to the like 
funding of getting this chapter 2 done and that was what the problem was, or is that something I did in the chapter 1? I can't remember. Shots aren't always as they appear. The bigger they are, the less to fear. You'll only get hurt a little inside. Take your pride and learn the signs. Fair enough, Chief. Alright, well, thank you for that. I'll try and remember. Finally, a dojo for people that are normal shaped. I will train myself for the tournaments. What tournament? Don't remember. <laughs> Looks like fighting wasn't in the cards for us. Lucky for you. Just hope you don't meet my friends. I don't remember who you are. <sighs> wow. Our house is a dojo. Makes me want to fight. Can't we go to sleep? Aw, oh, they're so cool. Hey, boss. Boss! Eh, I'm so glad to have a nice boss. I could shed a tear. But I won't! I'm on the job. I'll cry at home with the kids. Boss, you're strong, but there's always time to learn. The next step after tutorials is training. So me and the boys got you together a dojo. Complete our battle challenges and get some fabulous prizes. Meanwhile, you might want to get a little bit tougher. We're going to make you the strongest boss. Okay, so... So we could... So I'm wondering if we can do this now to get us back up to speed, or whether it, like he insinuates that we need to go and battle a bit more than it. No, let's do a challenge. Oh. Learn how to spare like a champ. That's going to be useful, so I've got to remember that. Uh, when we get Joe's life savings. Oh god, that sounds so depressing. Uh, gain 100% TP without getting hit. You can do it, boss. You get 100 bucks. And then, uh, it's not Clover's birthday anymore. She won't go easy on you now. Clover rematch. Don't remember Clover. Oh, Clover was... No, Clover's the three-headed thing, isn't it? I think. Alright, well, let's give it a go, then. No, I'll spare like a champ. We need to do that. Yes, please. Mm. Music was so good in this game. Boss, you can act and spare on the same turn. If you know Chris's act will give an enemy 100% mercy, spare them on the same turn with Susie or Rolsey. Um, the trouble is, how do we spare? Jigsaw Joe, check or shave? Uh, we should check. And then, um, yeah, spare Jigsaw Joe. And then you spare Jigsaw Joe. Jigsaw Joe, beat him up to earn his life savings. Susie spared Jigsaw Joe. But its name wasn't yellow, that's it. Well, she spared Jigsaw Joe, but his name wasn't yellow. Don't listen to that, that's the wrong axe, the wrong act. Jigs in, right, so I, th I think. So what we've got to do is shave, and then we spare them. Um, uh, we need to shave Jigsaw Joe stubble. Susie Pierce, spared, spared. Oh, boss, you're sparing. Yeah, because I remember. Oh, he's back. Wait a second. I got something else to remind you of. Boss, it works the same with making an enemy tired. If an act will make an enemy tired, your else is pacify right away. Yes, that was another thing as well. I remember that. Of course, pacify is magic, so you'll need TP. Spend some defending to gain TP. Yes, that makes sense as well. Right, so act, jigsaw, sleepy story. Um. And then uh, we'll defend for now. Susie told the enemy a bedtime story about beating them up. The enemy became tired. Jigsaw Joe drank coffee. Jigsaw stopped being tired. Damn it. Boss, you put me to sleep. I mean, you, you are. Make me tired and pacify me, boss. I was about to. Oh, it's magic, isn't it? Pacify. You did say magic. Sorry. I got that wrong. So the, the enemy about a uh, bedtime story became tired. Ralsei cast pacify. You did it, boss! If you can manage to spare enemies right away, battles will go a lot faster, that's all. Well, we need to do that anyway because we want the good enemy. Amazing battle! As promised, here is your reward. You received Joe's life savings of one dollar. Do you know what, Joe? You can have it back if you want, break, But if not, I'll take your buck and I'll make sure it goes far. Bless you. Hey, boss, how can I help you? Let's do the challenge. Uh, we want to do Grey's Challenge 1. So it looks like that there's potentially other challenges as we go along, so I'm guessing like we'll return here and then there'll be some extra challenges. Maybe that's where like the uh, hidden side boss is, a bit like the Jester guy. Uh, for, you know, the, 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 yeah, the Jester guy, I was going to say, uh, where we had to work out to do it, because I couldn't remember how to do it last time. We did do it in the end, but we, it took us a while to work it out. Grace! Ok, 
Okay, I'm, I'm concentrating here, by the way, guys. Not quite sure. Not quite sure if I'm doing this right, because I know we can't get hit. I think the idea is, yeah, we've got to get the TP up, so we've got to, like... Yeah, so that's it. So we are doing it right. We've just got to build our TP up and not get hit. That's fine. We can do this. This is straight. Yeah, there we go. <coughs> Excuse me. This is train us to get the TP up because that's really going to help us in the future. It seems a bit slower this time, so I'm thinking because I know when I played Chapter One, um, everything was sped up for whatever reason. I never got to the bottom of that problem. I think now it's on Steam. I think it's now slowed down to the speed it's meant to be, so that'll make it a bit easier for us. Not that it won't be hard, but I was still proud that we beat Jester super fast. Then I'm proud we did that. We received 100 bucks. Excellent. Doing well then. Hey boss, how can I help? Yeah, uh, we'll do a challenge. We want Clover rematch. Yeah, it was Clover. I thought you were Clover. We've got a spare, remember? So act, Clover. Um, topic. Long time to guess. Guess favourite thing. Yeah, let's do topic long. Choose the topic that Clover likes. Ooh. Turtleneck. No thanks. Wrong! Is that bad? Uh-oh. Nice to see you again. Please ignore them this time you die. Yeah, it's much easier this time. I'm not saying that we won't get hit or anything, but... Um, that's fine. Clover flashes a trio of terrible smiles. Um, so we want to act, Clover, topic long, and we want to choose uh, the number four. Ah, oh, come on. Okay. Oh, 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 god. oh, god. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. I've got to get you. Uh, drinking on the job is not going to help us on this one. How much health have we got left? Not much, as it turns out. Right. Use the topic that Clover likes. Uh, oh, number three. Yeah, not bad. It's okay. How do you? How well do you know us? Sorry about this. You know nothing, idiot. Yeah, we're so dead. Trying our best. Okay, again, health-wise, we could probably survive. Not the next one. No, we don't want to attack. Uh, we need to act, Clover. Topic. Um, oh, whole dice, whole, whole. I think whole. Yes, because I remember they they come up from the hole, didn't they? That that was a little bit of um, a little bit of memory. Oh god. See, the trouble with me is I haven't played. Uh, well, I did actually. I bought um, uh, Ratzion for the Switch. I bought a physical copy, so I spent a lot of money on it because I'm an idiot. And um, that's a it's a bit, it's a horizontal shooter. And it's a bullet hell shooter, so you've got to learn to dodge all that stuff. And I forgot this game's all about that sort of thing. Clover is whispering about cute boys. Well, that's helpful then. Uh, non birthday? Ah, shite. Damn it. Okay. Um, but, um, yes, I remember all this. This like We've got to get used to. Ah, crap. Am I still alive? Uh, yeah, I'm fine. It's whispering about cute boys. Topic. Let's have a look. It's black noise, but it's got to be birthday then. Yeah, here we go. Um, but like I said, um, yeah, uh, I forgot all the gameplay of this. It's all this stuff. Uh, I mean, it's not too hard. Like I said, I'll get used to it once I've readjusted myself. It smells like clover and dew. Now, I think we can spare. Yes, we can spare. Epic. There we go. Nice, that's gone well! An amazing battle! As promised, here is your reward when we received the club sandwich. That's good, so I think the club sandwich is uh, away. Oh my god, we've got all the other items from last time as well! Yeah, because I thought it could heal HP. Oh, that's so cool, he remembered it all. Oh, bless you, Toby, thanks for that. Hey, boss, how can I help you? I don't think it. Yes, there's no other challenges yet, but that's okay, we'll come back for that. It's a bed for three people, or one three-headed person. Yeah, that must be Clover then. Oh, that was really cool. Oh, thanks guys. That, that was great. That was. I appreciate. Oh, the, the the bad guys from the last game, uh, the last chapter. This guy always seems like he's enjoying life more than me. Maybe it's because he's a higher level. Thanks to you, Commander, we've been liberated. I hereby declare today National Ham Sandwich Day of Independence. 
That's awesome. Bow wow. I'm just a block. You are indeed. I'll take you away. But actually, are you though? Don't beg. Forget it. Did we go somewhere? I don't get it. Did we? Wait, I don't know, mate. I can't remember you guys, to be honest. Yeah, there we go. A bit liberated. Yeah, I was just checking. I've got to ch check the other uh, dialogues. Oh ho! Welcome to Mio Town. Also, I heard it's called Mio. Did that's the name that I give my character? Don't, don't you dare say that. Wow, well, house is a dojo. Makes me. Coming! Twelve seconds later. Yeah, sorry about that. Got uh, called down to have some tea. Maybe well, my dad bless him, so it's very kind of him. So yeah, right, anyway. Uh, what, what, what did you say? Uh, uh, oh my god, I've forgotten your name already! <laughs> no. It's a party every day, and I'm the oldest. We're the same age. Oh, bless you. Either way, it's good to see you. Right. Actually, I want to know your name now. I can't believe I've forgotten it already. Uh, Clover! God damn it, Clover. Three leaf Clover, yeah. Ha uh -huh. I'm a dumbass. Or oh, four leaf. Is there, no, isn't four leaf Clover supposed to be lucky? I forget. Ah, thou hast transplanted death us to thine castle town. And truly, a magnificent town of castles, it art. But ho! Oh, something art lacking th it filleth. Couldn't thou guys perhaps uh, bringe in an evil ruler or something? I'm, oh god! God, here comes that. I'm sure we can make something else. Out. Ooh. Seems like Hathi likes this place. She hopes you'll like it too. Oh, I forgot about Hathi. Who are you, Hathi? I forget. Either way, let's go to the top bakery. Uh, there's Lancer. Oh, uh, yeah, you! I remember you. Well, well, welcome to Top Bakery. I am this bakery smith, Malleus. I do not know what any of these strange tools are for. But using my skills, I can fuse items to create new ones. Oh, that's interesting. Uh, fix us. <laughs> okay, fix us. Your body is a weapon too. You must take care of it from time to time. Aha! Let's feel my technique. <laughs> Hmm. I remember you, you're funny. Well, well, don't you feel better after a nice massage? Ha <laughs> ha! I do. Welcome to the top bakery. Right, let's have a chat. Bread? What is this technique you speak of? Oh, is that what you're going to say? Get lost, come on. Oh, is that what you're going to Ah, oh, I had a bit of a cop out, but whatever. Right, let's try this fuse item set. So it's the double dark burger. It'll take two bites to finish. Oh, so it, at least it's already um, preordained for us. I was a bit worried. Uh, a square charm that increases drops money by five percent. I could just grind away on that one. Uh, twin ribbon, two ribbons. You'll have to put your hair into pigtails. Or obviously, we don't have these. Pure crystal. Okay, so I could do the double dark burger. Do I really need to do that right now? Probably not. Silver card. Eh, let's do the silver card. Aha! Let's feel my technique. <laughs> mm. We've got the silver card. Good times. Yeah, we'll have that. Okay. Ho ho ho! I am Chef Lancer. Try my delicious hand formed cookies. They are free. For a price. What's the price? Zero dollars. Alright, for sure. I now pronounce you Cookie and Wife. Lancer Cookie was added to your storage. Cheers, Chief. Can't do another one. Lancer Cookies, want one? I shall take one. You already took your cookie. Wait, I'm still regenerating from the last one. Alright, fair enough, Chief. I didn't mean to uh, be greedy. I was just curious. That's cool. Yes, I do remember him. I love the, the hammer technique. That <coughs> soft noise, that's funny. Right, okay, so it says storage, so... Can I not... I'm no, I'm, I'm not able to carry it with me, unfortunately. That's fine, we'll come back to it. We'll uh, locate it later. Did I speak to you outside the dojo? I can't remember now. Oh ho, welcome to Neo Town. Yes, I did. Yeah, Neo Town was named after me. Right, we've got a shop. Oh, you're weird. Uh, what can I buy? Dark Candy Dark Burger, another Amber card, which we don't need right now, or a Spooky Sword. 
Huh. Well, to be fair, it's not like we really need swords and things like that at the moment because we're going to try and spare them, so it's kind of a waste of money. But I guess we'll buy one anyway, just why not? Okay. Other than that, uh, now nah, we're good. Um, <laughs> take your time, mate, like it's better spent. I have no idea how to spend time other than I've got no choice but to spend it because you can't save time. Bam. No, you can't. You can't save time. You can only make time for other things. So we're here now, in a new world, and right off the heels of defeating that clown, incredible. Oh, that's referring to um, the jester guy. Oh, what's that? It seems like he gave something to you. Ah, that's right. You must not have noticed it. That crystal. It's nearly invisible, but you've been holding it this whole time. Here, I'll take it off your hands and appraise it. Incredible. Do you think he had a shadow crystal? Shadow crystals, so called because you can only see their shadow. Call it a premonition, but I get the feeling you may find more of these. In other words, expect more super bosses. If you continue to defeat strong adversaries like him, that is. Oh, I will, don't you worry about that. If you can gather uh, more shadow crystals, bring them here. I'm sure I can stitch together something incredible for you. Oh, you're on, Chief. So uh, yeah, you're just going to say that. That's fine. All right, yeah, you're on, Chief. I, I will do, like I said, I I'm going to explore as much of this game as possible and do any side bosses if I can. So don't you worry about that. Um, oh, well, we'll go then. See you again. Or not. <laughs> yeah, all right, you're the breaking the fourth wall meta guy. Um, which actually means we should equip. Who would gain, yeah, the wood blade. So let's do the spooky sword. Yes, yeah, so you can do that, can't you? Actually, who with... Um, where is my silver card? Oh, no, it went into the... Oh, bugger, it went into the inventory, didn't it? Hang on. So that's the same? It's a manual. Read a topic. Uh, item storage, yes. You will now have access to a storage menu at save points. When you're out of space, items you find or buy will be sent to your storage. Feel free to put things inside you might not be able to use yet. Okay, fair enough, Chief. Uh, I would like the silver card, though. Now, filled with the power of friendship based architecture. I'm sure they'll have some subtle meaning. Um, well, let's put some of these dark burgers away because it's not like we need them right now. Let's keep let's keep two on us. Um, and we'll keep a club sandwich in there as well. And then we will pick the Lancer cookie. Oh, hang on. Storage. Um, how do I... Um, ah, right. Oh, okay. It's a bit, bit weird. Um... Oh, oh, no, 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 there you go, that's it, and then, uh, oh, where's my silver card? Where's my silver card? I made a silver card, did I not pick it up from the shop? Uh-oh, I thought I did. Wait, no, the shop, the bakery. No, I pick it up from the bakery. It said I had a silver card. Whoa, where's my silver card? I had a silver card. Oh, there it is. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. Oh, I was confused then. Blimey, I was concerned. Right, okay. I got confused there. My apologies. Right, okay. Uh, let's go to the cafe then. Yes, I remember you as well. Mamma Miba wanted to run the bakery, but uh, someone's already working there. Cafe that serves pastries. What a disgrace. What sort of humiliating thing will happen next? Um, I don't know. Prize? I can only generate one spin cake at a time. Please finish your cake and I will give you another. Fair enough, Chief. Uh, welcome to the bakery, I wish. Uh, check recruits. Oh, these are the, um, guys we spared. Okay, so we can get some more information on the Rudin. Said to be someone's best friend. But maybe not. Shine on you, lazy diamond. So can we actually, like... Oh! Uh... Right? Weird. So we can place them in here, then. Is there any particular reason why we want to do that? I'm not sure. Hathi. Uh, so Hathi was an enemy. Just like a generic enemy, wasn't it? A heart with a big heart. Always supporting others with a bullet. Hmm. Well, Hathi's already around, so that's fine. 
Pond Man, a simple organism that takes life one square at a time. Aww. Um, Pond Man we haven't actually seen yet. I wonder if I can... Yeah, I'm going to switch around for that. Rabbit, a real dust bunny, known to play dirty but loves to play clean. Aww. Bloxer, yes, we saw him earlier. Shape-changing fighter, ironically blocking his nice forte. We've got Jigsaw. It cries uh, tears of joy that you are its boss. Um, we've seen Rudin Ranger. Obsessed with Ranger Shadows, it lets everyone know it's better than Rudin. And then Head Hathi. Although stronger than Hathi, he seems to have fewer friends. It dislikes being alone. Uh, okay. Well, I'm not quite sure how that works, to be honest. Jigsaw is there at the moment. So I'm wondering if this, like, like they can, like, um... I don't know. We'll work it out as we go along. The jukebox is broken. Feels like you might never find a working one. Oh, depressed. And I think I'm the rest. Alright, can I speak to you guys? Hey boss, I'll have a dark candy star face. Looks like it wants to osmo some flavourable cubes. Uh, Hathi's going to order a heart foam latte. Uh, lemonade, please. Well, hang on a minute. Hang on. Hathi, you're outside, girl. Actually, I'm going to change you up a bit. No, I've got one outside, so I'm going to check recruits. You, head Hathi, you can, you can, you can come out. Fuck you. That's fine. That sounds a bit mean, but I mean, like, um, yeah, there's already Hathi outside, so that's fine. Okay, right. Well, I think we've explored everything we can for now, so I think we'll save the game again. Uh, and we'll, we'll go on a little bit further before we finish this video. I know it's not much has happened, but again, I'm just trying to, um... I'm just trying to get into the swing of things, that's all. Oh, actually, I should go back to the book, just very quickly. Uh, control... Oh, recruits, yeah, here we go. If you spare or pacify enough enemies of the same type, they will be recruited. Recruits will appear in your town. I wonder what happens if you get them all. You can check the areas of recruit stations at save points. Certain bosses are excluded. Oh, okay. Oh, I suppose we'll roll with that later then. Um, right, hello, how are you? It's a bit scary moving to a new place, but as a ball, there's nothing to sphere except sphere itself. But uh, Prince Rolsey, I will keep your hat erect until you need it. Oh, bless you. Just wanted to show off your huge house, huh? No, what I want to show you is upstairs. Hmm. Okay. Oh, he's a tad nervous, but I'm sure it'll be fine. Second floor, living quarters. So that's upstairs then, and then that's downstairs. Okay. Uh, living quarters for bad guys. Ah, oh, well, I, I, I think we are kind of bad slightly. Yes, I forget. Yes, I remember now. These are some of the bosses, weren't they? It's violently protecting the jail. Yes, I remember those. They're quite nasty, aren't they? We're still behind bars for some reason, but it's okay. We've grown to love this hellish place where we dress as animals. <laughs> yeah, I think like they they're like um they were some of the bad guys from the chapter one. It says dress as kings, it's cultural exchange. Eh, whatever you want, chief. Ooh, who are you? Oh, you're the king. Ah, the lightness. Have you come to humiliate me? Uh no, I haven't actually. Mr. King, the lightness returned everyone here safely. If you're willing to reconsider, then... What? Live in a kingdom ruled by you? The lightness little patsy. Staying in this cell is far less humiliating. Ah, excuse me. My giant hamster wheel is getting cold. Oh yeah, so they've, uh, you know, banished him down here. Oh. By the way, is my son happy? Like you care. You were going to throw him off a cliff. I can't remember if that was true or not, but I'll take their word for it. Ah, your prejudice made my bluff too effective, I see. Uh, besides, even if I threw him, he would just... bounce. <laughs> my son is a bouncy little pumpkin. Oh, cute. We're done talking with you. Oh, yeah, he's happy, bro. You have nothing to discuss. He is happy. Yeah, I think he's happy. He's, he's currently at the bakery making cookies. He's happy. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, because this game, like I said, Undertale had a level of, like, deep maturity about it, and so did this as well. Oh, I nearly forgot, this is where I cook. You cook everything in a giant witch's pot? Of course! Cauldron cooking is very convenient. Here, Chris, Susie, have a cake. 
Yowzers. Hmm, a little thick on the frosting. Uh, that was for sharing. <laughs> hey, anyone was free to make an interception. <laughs> I like the fact that it exploded out of the thing, that was cool. Right, um, can I go in here? The door is locked, okay, fair enough. Okay, now we make a chocolate one. Why don't we go upstairs first? Alright, okay, let's not mess around then. Uh, I have a surprise for you two. I don't know if this is going to go well. I made rooms for you in the castle. Oh, or oh, oh, maybe not. Maybe it'd be fine. Rooms? Uh, so you can stay here whenever you want. Um, I'd be happy if this place could be like a second home to you. A place that you can go no matter what's happening outside. Yeah, well, I mean, that's great. But I'm a little bit suspicious. <laughs> well, we'll, uh, yeah, we'll take a look. All right, we'll go in my room then. It looks just like my room at home. It's a stand for your manual. I thought you might want to keep it here in case you want to read it. Sweet. Oh, okay. Fair enough. I thought there'd be a little more to it than that, but that's okay. It's your bed. It feels incredibly soft, like sleeping on a dream. Never heard that analogy before. That, that is the first one. It's some decorative moss. Looks delicious. Why the hell does your room get moss? I don't know. But that's where the stain was. So spish. It's a wardrobe full of all sorts of different clothes. You could wear whatever you want. But we won't, because the game says no. It's a shelf. All sorts of keepsakes could be put here. Okay, can I put keepsakes on here? No, apparently not. I'm sure, though, as the game progresses, we will add <laughs> stuff to it, probably. <laughs> cool, there's old Lance's room there. That's brilliant. So I'm assuming this is uh, Susie's. Oh, yes, it is. And Susie, this is your room. I tried to make it something you'd like, but you could put anything else you want in here, too. I really hope you like it. Oh, I hope Susie's not too harsh on it. She's probably going to go, oh, it's too cutesy and blah, blah, blah. Oh, there, it's got devil horns on the wardrobe. My own room, huh? I... I guess that's pretty cool. My own room. Like this. How long did it, uh, take you to do this? Well, uh, since I last saw you two, I... <laughs> punch. No, I know, it was only a, like a shoulder punch. You're a real weenie, you know that? <laughs> I think she likes it, Chris. Yeah, she does. Yeah, <laughs> jealous. I got the cool room now. Look, Chris. Look, I just ripped my heart out at the end of chapter one. I think I've got other things to be worrying about. Oh, that's sweet. Damn, it's everything in here. Uh, pine cones, chalk, moss, jars of salsa, pieces of ice, black crumbs from the toaster, jawbreakers. Oh, and like actual food too. Cool, spike bed. Now I can stab myself during the night. Finally, some convenience. <laughs> Shouldn't laugh at that, but it is kind of funny. Susie, you didn't get to read the manual, so I put it over here for you. Cool, I'll read it before bed. That'll put me to sleep. It's a clothes drawer full of spiky and dangerous clothing. All the clothes are ripping each other up into shreds. Hell yeah! Jealous, Chris? Uh, you're fine. Oh yeah, sorry, that's the manual thing, I do apologise. Okay, well that's cool. Well, okay, at least Chris appreciates it, that's the main thing. Sweet, and then of course there's Lance... Ooh, Ooh that's blocked. We'll come to that in a minute. Can we go to Lance's room? <laughs> of course. I'm going to assume these things on the floor make noises. Lance, you aren't going to believe how sick my room is. A room as sick as you? <laughs> I want to see. I'll keep digging holes until I reach your room. Oh, he's digging holes. Yes, there's a shovel on the right. I thought it was a carrot, to be honest with you, but no, that's fine. I don't know why I thought it was a carrot. How can you grow carrots in your room? I'm sure there's a way you could do it. Uh, it's got a door, you know. A door? Wow, Peach Boy, you all went out. And that's it, is it? I love that my floor is full of holes. <laughs> I'm sure you do, Lance. I'm sure you do. Bless him. Oh wow, it's better than I remember. I even have my own bed now. 
Now I don't have to sleep in a hole anymore. I thought you already had a bed. No, no, that was for the bike. <laughs> that was fun. Ah, oh, they've all shown their tongue. Oh, yeah. Uh, it's a music player. Listen to the contents. It's a music player? Yeah, sure. Of course. It's full of cartoon splat noises. Can I, can I do it again? Of course. I'll pay you money if you like persevered this for a while. You'll hear some sort of hidden message. Like if you did that like a hundred times or something like that. Or something stupid. Then eventually there'll be a message from, say, Toby Skull or something saying... To get to the secret blah, use this blah or some sort of thing, Easter egg thing. Maybe even a law thing or something. I don't know. It's some kind of digging implement. I bet any money there'll be something like that. <laughs> but anyway, whatever. Um, hey, Rousey, what's up here? Oh, uh, just more rooms I'm renovating. So is your room up there? Uh, yes, I still um I haven't dusted it though. Yeah, like we need to see your nerdy glasses collection anyway. Alright, well that's very kind of you. Thank you, Rousey. That's very nice of you. Uh, hopefully, uh, hopefully uh, we'll make use of this. So, uh, what do we do now? Uh, well, feel free to explore the town until you're ready to leave. Ha! Like we're going to leave now, right, Chris? Um, I, I, uh, I, yeah, I guess. I guess it's... About strawberry cake as a room warming gift. There's a slice of cake in your fridge, Susie. But it's not cold and fresh. Alright, I'll go back and see if we talk to these guys, see if they say anything different. Nah, no, it's gonna be the same thing. But yeah, the only reason why I'm saying this is because, like I said, this, the, the game's basically saying, look, you can explore this place and um, do things before you go or we'll do the next bit. So I'm just wondering if anything else extra. No, that's fine. Okay. It's good that the game so far has been pretty sort of self-contained. Maybe I'm sort of overthinking a little bit about uh, hidden extras and stuff. Oh yeah, is there no chance of going there again? No, the door's locked. Okay, that's fine. Okay, I'm going to say the same as before. Okay, that's fine. So, again, okay, just quick talk to these. Yeah, he's going to say the same thing as well. So it's the other guy. That's fine. Uh, I am making an assumption there, but I don't want to like overdo this. Right, we'll save. Uh, yes, the Flower Friendship Architecture. We'll save. Uh, we'll do like three files. So if I make a mistake or something, hopefully I'll have a safe way to go back to to fix it. Sorry, I'm getting tired. It's part of me getting older, unfortunately. It's a clean start for us here. Sucky. Yeah, I, oh, I didn't see you before. Sorry, Bo. I, I, I ignored you there. Right, so all this is done now, so now what do we do? Because again, that's the dusty hole. Oh, hello, didn't notice you there. Oh, it's quite a wonderful town, really, thank you. So, why am I alone here? Bit of self-reflection, I suppose. Uh, I do realise I was quite a coward before. So I wanted to say, well... I said that! My cards, I cannot handle society. For now, I'll be living top of this cliff. When I'm ready to meet society again, I'll be back. Thank you. Thank you for the wonderful home. I will not use it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I each of their own, bro. There's a hole in the wall. There's nothing inside. Oh, who took my hole? Who took the, who took my hole? Who took the thing in my hole? That didn't sound, that didn't sound right either. Hey, yeah, things have changed. Ooh, what have we got here? Mr. Society left, didn't he? Mm. I reckon I knew uh, this would have happened. It's not no fault of yours. He'll be back one day. Oh, was, that a th was I not supposed to do that? Uh oh. Oh, it must be an east. Uh, it must be a secret thing. Oh crap. Okay, never mind. I'll, 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 I'm sure you guys and girls will tell me, and if not, I'll research it. It's not our fault. It's not no fault of yours. He'll be back one day. Uh, okay, uh, hopefully it's a law thing, like um, a main thing we left. Like think about, oh Christ, it's a secret thing. I've got to do something special or whatever. Um, but I did save it before that happened. So I'll try not to overwrite that. Well, I probably will inevitably, but anyway. Without trees, I must gain nutrients by eating clothes. Such is the way of the worm. 
Looks like the clothes are nibbled. Take a bite? Yes. You put your mouth against the mannequin's cheek. C -c 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 Chris! Don't bother. It tastes awful. <laughs> and Susie? <laughs> Ace base. Right. Oh, boxy dude. I like being like this. Don't tell anybody. Well, as you were before. It seems to be locked. It may never open again. Oh, right. Well, where am I supposed to go then? Am I got to go back to the classroom then? Is that the whole point? I guess so. Okay. Wait, Chris, we're leaving, but we just got here. Man, I don't want to go to a. We don't. I don't want to go do a group project. Oh, you two have homework. Uh, well, Susie, Chris, you ought to do it right away. School's important. I banish you from this kingdom until you start your project. Ah, uh, fine, I'll do it, Jays. Susie, don't worry. I'll go and help you too. Uh, wait, Lancer, perhaps you shouldn't. Too late, kind boy, friendship for me. Lancer was added to your key items. I don't want to know what that means. Uh, where did you go? Don't worry, I just entered your inventory. I'll just be hanging out in Chris's pocket. I don't know what that means, but okay. Fear not, I too shall assist this. Uh, we're good. Aha, quite. We as a team aren't good. Uh, Ruxels or Rusels became a key item, even though no one wanted that. I will also join. The original Starwalker became a key item. Um, okay. Is that a joke or is that something I should be concerned about? Because it's in yellow text. Alright, enough already. Let's get going. Good luck today, Chris. See you soon. Oh god, god, so we are leaving this. We are going back to reality then. Oh, before we do, can we head back? Come back when you finalise your... Uh, when you finalise... Sorry, the drink's getting to me now. I do apologise. Come back when you finish your homework. What's the point of having a room if you can't slack off in it? That is a good point, Chris. Uh, that's a good point, Susie. Yeah. Right, so we're going to go back to the real world then. That is interesting. Well, damn, guess we got to do a project. <sighs> At least we got Lancer, right? Lancer? Where are you? Damn, I guess he skipped out after all, though. Hmm. So where should we do this? What? The library? Ugh. Well, alright. Now, ah, uh, so we're back to level one now, and with only two dollars. Ball of junk. Ball of junk, a small ball of accumulated things in your pockets. So he's... cards. Cards, the Jack of Spades and the Rules card. Um, hmm. So he's not Halloween pencil and bandage. Right, okay. So, I guess, oh, excuse me, sorry. I'm going to have to stop the video in a bit. Do apologise. I don't want to have. I was enjoyed the first bit. Now I got distracted by food and tea and all that. I don't want to. Uh, I don't want to get like all bleh, slurry and, and 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 not pay attention to this too seriously because I really want to. Really do want to give this game a good, good you know, a good go basically. Managed to cram everything into the closet, even the rug. Yeah, we mentioned that before. Didn't we? Oh, that's missing. And I can't turn off the light. Oh, well, I guess we're not concerned about global warming then. No, fuck that shit. So I'm guessing then maybe some of this game is going to take place in our world? As in this world? I say our world or real world. Of course, that would be weird. Not that would be weird. It'd be cool, but I wouldn't expect that. I meant like in this weird world, you know, the world that Chris and uh, Susie belong to. Interesting. Are you ready for the Sadie Hawksman's dance? Or Sadie Hawksman's dance, even. At this dance, all the chaperones wear giant hawk heads. And screech at any students that make contact while dancing. Oh, that sounds great. Uh not sure, bro. I'm not sure. 
so, ah, it's our classroom, isn't it? Right, it's a bunch of rooms. Can I get the computer? Okay. So, same as before. Anything on here? Looks like motivational quotes from various literature. Try your best, Astral Wolf. Oh, no, we've already read that, haven't we? Oh, God's sake. Sorry. Uh, I'm just checking the desks, really, to see if there's anything hidden. I just want to be thorough. Again, I sort of apologise if this is boring. I was very sorry. The locker is locked. The locker's lock is locked. The locker's locker. Lock. The lock's locker is locked. Hang on a minute. The locker's lock. Lock. The locker's locks. Locker is locked. <laughs> Bass. Fuck it out, Toby. <laughs> the locker is locked. The locker is covered in Jockington memorabilia. The locker is locked. The locker is locked. I. Oh, oh, you see, it's doing mind tricks. It's doing mind tricks. Oh, I see. It's doing mind tricks. That's clever. Oh, bless you, Toby. That's clever. <laughs> it's doing tricks. Do you like breathing, moving fast with or without legs? But usually with legs? Well, yeah, I kind of like both. Join the cross country team with Jockington and Noel. Oh, I'm sure I'll try and get Susie to join. He ran the world's fans in its league world. Okay, he said the same as before. Locker. It's locked. Locker. It's locked. Locker. It's locked. This used to be your brother's locker. Oh, yes! We had a brother. Forget who he is. It's your locker. It's empty. Yeah, um. Azriel, I believe, is our brother. Uh, at least in this uh, universe, anyway. Miss Toriel is written in cursive on the dry erase board. Seems like it hasn't been erased in a very long time. Oh, I guess because, you know. It's just there, always in the top left corner. I used to have a whiteboard where I'd write the date on, and then I'd only change the the number in the day, but the actual month would stay there and get, like, obviously it would stick on after a while, and then when you have to change the month to the next month, or even the year or whatever, it was always harder to wipe off because it'd been there for so long. That's fair enough. It's a poster of several basic shapes. Circle, oval, square. Hyper... Yeah, ha-ha. Hyper dodecahedron. Course. And I bet that is a basic shape as well. I'm just being dumb. A B C D E F G H I J K L M N O P Q R C T U V W X Y Z A B C D. I was just thinking that I was looking at the alphabet at the top, and that's it's definitely the alphabet. Kids' books. Some of them used to be yours. What are they doing on my shelf though? I'm back. It's a primitive drawing of your mom. Hmm. It's an orange. It's unknown if it's safe for teachers to eat this. Is it? I don't know why though. Computer wallpaper is updated. It's a picture of your brother and you playing video games. Your brother is using the knockoff controller. This is our mum's classroom. I didn't realise that I forgot our mum's a teacher. That makes sense now. Yes. Uh, well, I say our mum. The, the, the uh, goat lady woman. Yes, I. That makes it. That that rings. That rings bells. The throne of the gods grows higher. Is this hubris? <laughs> All right then. So where's the library then? Is that? I'm guessing that's in town then. I'm guessing it's not in the school then. So yeah, I guess we can leave the school then. Like I said, I'm not trying to deliberately waste time or anything here. Uh. I was just going to say I was hearing horns and stuff like that. Oh. So the soundtrack to the town is a load of horns from the the traffic jam. I heard a dog was doing donuts, so I sped over here. But I just learned donuts is actually the name of a special attack for cars. Why is my life stuck in a loop of doughy disappointments? Join the club, bro. Join the club. Damn, I was just directing traffic as normal when a little dog drove over one of those toy cars. It's the middle of the street and started doing donuts. In the chaos, all the cars in town got jammed up. Thankfully, no one was hurt. But ordinary citizens like you gotta get out of here. I've got some heavy lifting to do. Uh, okay. Traffic's moving at a snail's pace. I love snails. Could today get any better? <laughs> Looks like a car. Looks like a car. So yeah, it's to stop us from going through the rest of the town then. 
my life like a donut. It's stuck in a loop of, uh, loop of doughy disappointment. Like I said, join the club. Okay, so we're stuck. We, we have to go to the library then. All right. Well, I'll tell you what. We'll go into the library. We'll get started on here, and then if there's a save point, we'll 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 stop the video there. All right. We're here. School. Goddamn. Project. Books. God. Damn. Crazy about them. Hey, Chris. Where the hell is everybody? Something seems kind of. Oh. Screw it. Let's just go play some space pinball in the computer lab. <laughs> oh. Uh oh. Huh? It's like. The inside of the closet. Chris. You don't think this could be. Another dark world. Could be. Interesting. Well, guess this means we can't start our project. Unless, you know, Chris, if there's a dark fountain in there, you can seal it. And it'll turn back into the computer lab, right? So what's it going to be, Chris? To be honest, we, we could just use the computer at my house. Chris. You're right. Like, you said a correct fact. But you made a mistake. The mistake of knowing me. Because when I see a big pit, all I want to do is jump in. And as long as you're with me, I'm dragging you in soon. Come on, Chris. Okay. I, I only said that as a joke. <laughs> Alright, so even though we had a brief sort of like a feel for the real world in terms of we're armed with a pencil and other bits and bobs and our level's only level one. I'm guessing the combat isn't done in the real world then. I'm not saying necessarily in this chapter, but in the game. But I don't know. I don't know. It's early days. Gotta stop hypothesizing. Let's just try and remember these things and, and see if it adds up to anything. This is new. It is actually. You're quite right. It looks cool. Looks funky. Looks like um Stardust Valley, the Sonic the Hedgehog 1 level 5, Stardew Valley, or Stardew Lane, Stardust Lane, or something like that. I don't know. But I'll tell you what, I'm going to be mean. There is a plug dangling in the uh, in the dark void there. I'm going to save the game. And we're going to call that a video, I think. So uh, thank you very much for watching this, if you have done. Sorry that I got a bit more drunk towards the end. That wasn't the plan. Uh, but I had some tea in between. And I'm like, all oh, relaxed and happy and all that. But yeah, I'm starting to be like, Ugh, and I don't particularly want to be, you know, in a state of not really focusing on things, remembering things. I really am looking forward to playing this game. So uh, yeah, expect some more videos on this soon, as well as um, the dealer's life we've got to get back to that and i do need to finish uh tales of Berseria. i was actually going to potentially finish that tonight and then i got tempted to do delta delta room chapter two instead so that's why we're doing this uh but yeah so that's all hopefully gonna be back on track so yeah it's good to be back and again sorry i'm not trying to do these videos drunk i know it sounds a bit wrong and it seems a bit unprofessional of me that's not the plan i'm just relaxing it's been a long day at work and i always like to have a drink after work um even though i promised people i wouldn't Oh, yeah. Don't tell anyone. Um, but, uh, yeah, other way, looking forward to this. So, can I say thank you very much for watching if you have done. I hope you're all well. Stay safe. Take it easy. Have a good one in these troubled times. And I'll see you in the next video. And until then, bye for now.